Hello and what is going on guys? My name is Insanely and welcome to another episode of uh, Witcher 2. That was weird intro number 267. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. But I've been to the dentist, everything is alright, everything worked out. I have another appointment in a month which will fall into March. Which means a big month, if something goes wrong there, I'm gonna be in big trouble content-wise. Because I wanna do a lot of stuff. But, whatever. We are back in The Witcher, and I actually played all of this before, but I died and I lost everything, and that was stupid. I didn't want to replay it, so I thought, well, there is no difference in doing this right now, what I'm doing here. So what I did before, since I'm really eager to get... Critical mutagens, I spec side effect. I built some stuff to see if I can get greater critical ones. I never once got one. So I had two of them in there. I've crafted like six times about 20 or so pots. And I never really got, or not never really, but I never got any cre greater critical mutagens. So that didn't work out. And then I had a fight where I died. And I thought footwork will be a good addition to what I need. So I'm not gonna go with the alchemy talent. I'm gonna go with footwork. I don't know if I'm gonna go with two in footwork or one. I think I'm gonna go with the two. Now we are really agile. Like holy cow. That is really damn good. And we, we can continue now, and you can already see down there. There's some nice stuff there, huh? Yeah, we want to go there anyways. So let's follow your path. How do you put your stuff away again? No, that's not it. I haven't played this in a while. Ah, like that. Okay. The last session was before my dentist appointment, and it never really... I never really played that much after that, so... Here we go, a little cutscene, I'm gonna shut up. Knights of the Flaming Rose at a peace summit. I wonder whose side they're on. On that of whoever paid them. Huh. Alright. You shouldn't let them see you. I know. To them, a good elf is a dead elf. It's not because you're an elf, it's because you're Yorvith. I'll try to enter the city through the caves. I'd advise you to do the same. The knights will know I'm wanted. You know of a passage? I know of a cave nearby. There are many ways to enter Loch Muin, my friend. If Radovid has summoned the Order, I'm certain the others have brought their armies as well. The city must be full of soldiers. All of them sitting as if on a witch's bomb, waiting for a spark. But that may be to our advantage. If the rulers have holed themselves up in camps, it should be easy to move about between them. Let's go before we get noticed. Alright. I actually tried going that way. And let's say I got swarmed by about 30 guys and it didn't go too well. Okay, so right now, we can follow Yorveth this way. Or, we can do something different. And I don't really need to drink up, but I know what's coming up. It's a little bit of more fighting, so... I actually wandered around looking for this little passage here. The first time around, which was really stupid, but yeah. At least I didn't lose too much content, I guess. I lost like maybe... Well, it was about 30 minutes because I was running around a lot, but... Yep, his medallion. It goes off because of that dude. And there is a dude behind me. I should have saved, huh? Now I'm dead. Now you can see what I mean with, uh... This is fucking dumb. Okay, this... Didn't happen the last time. I'm gonna reload and I'm gonna see you guys right there. I don't know why I died. I'm so fucking pissed off right now. I'm so mad, but I'm gonna see you guys back there when I'm... Yeah. I'm gonna skip all of the other shit. See you then. Okay, I'm back. 
And I hope this time I won't die. This is the only thing that I don't like that much is the save system in this game. I don't know. Either go all out like Dark Souls or have something that's a little bit more forgiving where you... I mean, I didn't lose that much progress right now, but there is a big chance that you lose progress and just spamming safe all the time is not fun. But right now, I need to be fast to get past this guy. Get him to run into an Urden. And then it's really easy to kill him. That's how I did it the last time as well, so... If you have that... You have a really easy chance of fighting them, so... That was that. Really easy if you can get by him. I got by him without the fast roll the last time as well, so you don't really need that to get past. But... Since we are here now, we can loot some stuff. Since I'm Mr. Mod, I'm good. And here we got actually the thing that I came for. That was the wrong menu. And what I came for was this bad boy. Daithwen, or something like that. Yep. That's a monster. We will wear that. It's pretty good. It has 25% more damage against large monsters and 25% extra damage against gargoyles. That might come in handy, right? So, right now we need some fire runes. I only have two though, which is a little unfortunate. And it bugs out a little bit all the time. I don't know why. I need a third one. We will craft one once we can actually craft. I have still the draw trophy and everything else is pretty much the same, so... What we can do now, since we have the cool roll, uh, let me say first, is actually be really fast in this game. We are ten times faster than... And you can see there's another one of those bad boys. We are really fucking fast now. Good you're here. Look what I found. Keep your distance. Already forgotten that a similar creature hung around my place. Hey, a lot of thingies running around here. <laughs> Andriga Warrior. Yeah, the damage I'm doing right now is pretty ridiculous he burned up now of course I want to loot them who knows what I need the materials for I actually want him to run into it then go behind him spam big attacks footwork is such a good talent man It is so good! You don't need to worry about dodging anymore that much. Okay. Quick little side note, I'm gonna do some Dark Souls soon. And probably it will already be out once you are seeing this. Depending if I actually modify my upload schedule that I have right now for the other videos, so... I'm not entirely sure, but I want to do one more playthrough before the second one is out. So I have a, about a, a month or two. Almost two, since I'm going to do the PC version, which is not that nice. I mean, it comes out like two weeks later, maybe, and that's unfortunate. A but valley on the other side of the city, once teeming with wildlife, it's now dead. The royal delegations arrive here. Now comes the section that I I played up to here and a little bit further, but I don't like the section. What exactly killed the Vrans? As the years went by and the climate turned colder, the Vrans had less and less. For this, I get interrupted all the time now. The 
So you can't really listen to what he has to say, right? That's a little stupid. But you can read the subtitles, that's what they are for, they I guess. They tried to save themselves, building an aqueduct and sewers that rival today's. But it grew colder, and the canals remained frozen for most of the year. So, this is where I played up to and a little bit further, like maybe another when 30 the seconds. When arrived, they encountered only ghosts. A dead city falling into ruin. The Enshe rebuilt it, restored its former beauty. Humans did not arrive here for many more years. Marshal Raupenek then swiftly proved himself more deadly than all diseases combined. He attacked at night, murdering all the city's inhabitants. We're in Loch Nguyen. We're on the fringes somewhere. We should find what we came for nearer the main quarters. Let's go.